Hello YouTube, this is Dre and I'm going to show you how to lock your certain folders on Windows 7. You can most likely do this on Windows XP or Vista, but I'm using Windows 7 because I have it. Um, what you want to first do, it is a downloadable, but it's free and it's very small sized and it's virus free. So, let me just refresh this. Okay, it's 1.24 KB, which is very small. So download it. We want to do it, is save it first, and you'll save it in your under your documents or anywhere you want it. I want to recommend the desktop, but you'll understand why after. Well, I'm going to save it under my documents, though. Press save, and I'm done already. It's that fast. Okay, now you want to open up your documents, and you want to create a folder named Personal. And it has to be spelled right too. Okay, and once you get that, see I have stuff in here. And it's gonna be my personal folder that I don't want any other person to see. Okay, now you gotta scroll down and you gotta go find this folder text document called Locker. Now you click it and open it up, and it's under notepad, so you can open it up. Now it looks like it's a bunch of scripting that looks like it looks overwhelming. Well, it's not that hard actually. You have to find this part where it says if not percent pass percent equals equals password. Go to fail. You want to get rid of the word password, and that's you gotta replace it with your password itself. So my password, I'm just gonna make it one two three four five. Now I'll scroll down a bit. You'll see the same line further down. And just write the same. Th get rid of the word password and click. And two, three, four, five, or wherever password you want it to be. And what this is doing is there's, um, I can show you first. So, what you want to do right now is go save as, file save as. Now, I will save under your documents again. It will make a lot of sense to do that. But instead of, put locker as your file name, but instead of doing a txt document, click put it at the end of locker, put period bat. And that's a batch file. Not sure what batch file means. Okay, you saved it so you can X this out. Not sure what back, see Windows batch file. I'm not sure what that means, but it's just a file, I guess. Now it says, are you sure you want to lock this folder? Yes or no? Y for yes and for no. Okay, I'm going to say yes. Because I already had it open. See, now that personal one folder was gone. Now you click this again, and this is your, like, entry to that folder. So now it's asking me to enter a password to unlock that folder. Now I'm going to put in 12345 in my password. Press enter. And my personal folder is there again. That's how you do it. It's the easy. Let me see. Should I unlock the folder? Yes. And now that folder is gone, which is nice. Um. Yeah, but here's the only problem. If you know someone that's doing this way of logging folders, you can just go into this file again and see the password and then put their password in and then I'll go into their folders and see what they have hidden. So if like what I have, I have stupid parents, so they have no idea about computers. So this will be perfect because they will have no idea how to do this. So that's my tutorial, and thanks for watching, and subscribe. See ya.